Hello everyone. I know you want to speak Korean very well. So speaking Korean is easy. You should remember only one word ending. That is yo. So yo can be used for any meaning. For example, you want to drink water and you want to ask somebody to give you water. You can say mul yo. And then you want to go to bed, you can say 잠요. And you want to go to a restaurant and want to eat food, and you say 밤요. And you want to say use 요. 요 can be used for any case. 요 is the really important key. Don't try to remember any verbs. Just noun yo. Okay? So, for example, you want to sit down, then you need to remember chair. Chair in Korean is uja. Uja yo. Which means you want to sit down. Or you are asking somebody to sit down. So, yo can imply any, any meaning. So, okay, so yo is polite form of ending. Yo is used, is versatile, and it can be used anytime. So, remember yo in Korea when you don't remember other verbs appropriate for the situation. So, you are going through a crowd and you want to pass through without touching them. And you say you are people, so 사람요. And you you also say you can say you have some kind of a luggage, and you want to ask them to avoid 짐요. And then you want to take a taxi, 택시요. Somebody will ask, somebody will guide you to taxi stand. And you go to a bus depot, and you want to buy ticket. You want to say 표요. 표 means uh, ticket. And then you want to take bus and you want to say bus yo. So why don't you try to remember only noun and verb? So remember yo. And if yo does not work, please write comment in this video. Thank you.